Okay, seventh graders, we are looking at the last type of um, rock today. So we did igneous, we did sedimentary, and now today is metamorphic rocks. <clears throat> so our My Planet Diary is a misconception. It's about rock dough. So the misconception is rocks do not change form. Did you know that, that heat can change a rock's form without melting it? To understand how, think of what happens when you bake cookies. You might mix flour, eggs, sugar, and baking powder in a bowl. When you bake the raw dough in a hot oven, the dough changes into cookies. Heat can change rock too. If hot magma or lava come near rock, the heat can bake the rock. The ingredients in the rock, which are the minerals, might not melt. But the heat can still change the rock into a new form. So does rock have to melt in order to change form? No, heat can change the rock without melting it. There's one key question today, and that's what are metamorphic rocks? So, any rock that forms from another rock as a result of changes in heat or pressure, or both heat and pressure, is a metamorphic rock. It can form out of igneous, sedimentary, or other metamorphic rocks. Pockets of magma or collisions between Earth's plate can change rock into metamorphic rock. Pressure can change the shape of the rock. The deeper the rock is in the crust, the greater the pressure. The minerals in a rock can also be changed into other minerals if the pressure or temperature is very high. Uh, geologists classify metamorphic rocks according to the arrangement of the grains making up the rocks. So foliated is a term used to describe metamorphic rocks that have grains arranged in parallel layers or bands. Non-foliated rocks have mineral grains that are arranged randomly. Oops, sorry. So, for example, quartzite and marble. The metamorphic rock, rocks, marble, and slate are important materials for building and sculpture. So, marble and slate are two of the most useful metamorphic rocks. Marble is easy to polish. It's used for many statues and buildings, such as the Tower of Pisa, which you see here. Slate comes in many colors, gray, red, purple, and etc. And it splits into flat pieces easily. So, slate can be used in roofing on roofing, outdoor walkways, and as a trim for stone buildings. So just one vocab word today. Foliated is a term used to describe metamorphic rocks that have grains arranged in parallel layers or bands. And your assignment is to complete the Edmodal questions for lesson five. Uh, it will be a, maybe a shorter quiz today uh, because of the short lesson. Let me know if you have any questions and do your best.